ready. All right, today guys, we're working with the CFX 750 display. Uh, we're gonna show you how to wire up a coverage logging switch. So currently it's, it's set to manual, so whenever you're in the field and you wanna count acres or get a coverage event happening, you have to hit the, uh, the boom set uh, switch here to turn it green. So when it's green, it's, it's counting acres or covers logging, painting the screen yellow uh, as you're going through the field. And for people that are using spray controllers and those types of things, the three-point lifts, um, we can put in a, a, a cable system that will actually allow this to happen automatically. So whenever the lift goes down or whenever you flip a switch on, um, it will automatically turn this on and, and start counting your acres. Let me show you how to set up the display for that. So we're gonna go into our settings. We're gonna go to guidance and then coverage settings. And under coverage settings, you have a coverage on off delay. So if you wanted it to have a delay, so as it went down and then automatically it would start counting, most people just leave that set to zero. And you see here coverage logging, your setting is set to manual. So that means you manually have to hit that button every time you wanna start counting acres and also to hit it to turn it off. Um, so we wanna put this on a switch there's other options if you were using autopilot or easy pilot, then you could do when engaged. So anytime that the system was engaged in steering for you, that it would actually start counting acres also. In this case, we're gonna set it to switch and hit the green check. And you see here you have some new options. So under covers logging input, covers logging on high or active high means that whenever there's 12 volts going into this switch is triggering this relay and causing it to give us continuity in our display to give us uh, logging, covers logging. Uh, you can also set that to active low, meaning that it will lose continuity and, and start logging. That's the only difference between these two settings is one is you have continuity uh, going into the display. The other one is you have no continuity. So whenever you are using the system in different ways, you can adjust for that. In this case, we're gonna be using a switch and, and sending continuity into the display. So we're gonna be active on high we're gonna go all the way back to our screen. And with the switch, when it comes on, it starts logging. When it turns off, it stops. And we're just going in through this, This uh, we have this relay here, so we're shooting 12 volts and activating this relay. And it's causing um, our continuity to close, our relay to close, and sending it into our port A connector. If you can get that. It will not work in port B. Um, so it will only work in port A and it's going to be on pins 10 and 11 going into the back of the display. So again, this is how we set up covers logging using a switch uh, with a 12 volt relay. Uh, thank you for watching and I hope this helps you.